Come on. Hi everyone, how are you doing? So, um, they call this the inner city because this is proper London city. So I'm in Bank, I've just got off the Central Line. Uh, I'm off for something to eat today. And you can also get to this place on the District and Central Line uh, and get off at Cannon Street. But I come off at Bank today, uh, but you can take your pick. But today, we're off for some Indian cuisine. Nice and spicy and hot with a bit of luck. But it's a place called The Indian. So that stood out for me. So I'm um, gonna go and take a look. But before I do, I'll show you the streets of London. If only I could play that song. Um, but this is proper London City. You can also get off at Monument Station and you can probably just see behind me uh, in between those buildings the monument. makes me think for years growing up we used to not take the mickey but um, not take the Samaritan seriously but we're in a world now where do you know what we've all got mental health it's how, how we're dealing with it sorry guys it's not the best walking camera in the world um, but I just wanted to point out that from Bank to Cannon Street there's a bit of a walkthrough and this is it. You can literally walk through. It's a bit of a shortcut, really. It takes you through straight to Cannon Street Station. Yeah, so bad hair day. Um, you walk along Cannon Street and then you turn off at College Hill, just there, and then you come into Cloak Lane. And then literally down that little alley or narrow road is the Indian. So yeah, very easy to find. Uh, probably, the, probably the easiest way to walk is from Cannon Street Station. Uh, it's literally two minutes away. But it's nice to have a look around. I mean, Bank is literally another few minutes uh, down that cut through.
you should know me by now I've come early so it's not as busy you must you must think um, oh he goes to all the empty places that's not that's not true it's uh, just that I like to get ahead of people uh, because sometimes it's not fair to film people that don't want to be on camera so I'm here to try the food and uh, looking forward to it a tricky one because usually they have um, cobra or kingfisher and they've actually got both so I couldn't decide so um, I asked him to decide for me and he said kingfisher so we're going with that thank you thanks the tortoise yeah yeah good is the garlic chili chicken quite hot yeah hot sir. yeah good I'll, uh, I'll have... hot is okay or you want more more hot uh, Madras is it like a more than medium? It's it's medium, is it? Uh, more than medium. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I mean, the, if it's hot, it's good. Sure. Yeah. Uh, I'll have that and and the sagaloo, please. The, if you order this one, yeah. good all. Yeah, just you can choose rice or none. Okay, uh, rice. Please. Rice. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Oh. Yeah. Tasty mango chutney. That's really good. <laughs> Wow. Sorry about the background noise, but um, that is amazing. Lime chutney, but it's so good. Oh, 
したいけど日本で構わなかったフライブスチャイタタンとのパイシェン Just the spinach and the coconut. What can I say? What can I say? Everything, absolutely everything. Oh, yeah, garlic, chili, chicken. I don't know what to say. I really don't. That, ladies and gentlemen, was absolutely off the charts. That, that food, Ducati there, that food was, do you know what, some of the best Indian food I've tasted. And it's a hidden gem, and I'll tell you why. When you walk in, you go downstairs, and you go into, it's like a cave. But that's not it. That's just where I at. But uh, Leon, the manager, took me out the back and showed me another section by the bar and then behind that, another section to seat up to 60 people. Amazing. Um, the service from Hussein, or Hussein. Hi, how you doing? He said to give him a mention. Um, great table service, hospitality, uh, on point. I cannot fault this place you have to try it and you know what you can see it behind me that's Cannon Street Station so that's how close you are on the Circle and District line guys if you're in the area if you're visiting St Paul's or you're near the monument or even London Bridge or just anywhere around there in the city come and visit the Indian amazing that for now this is Dan and John, just off Cloak Lane. I'll see you in the next one.
you know what I love about London as well? When I used to uh, not live, when I used to work like in a city for about three years, I used to come to Cannon Street, um, the, the Cannon Street Underground Station, and I used to walk up this road probably a thousand times. I've done it. Never knew that place was there. That's what I love about London, the hidden gems. And I love finding them. 